So welcome back to what I think is going to be part 26 of my playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2, my 100% playthrough. Now there is a bit of story behind today's episode because I attempted to stream it on Saturday night and the last two streams I did were really successful and I really enjoyed them but tonight's stream didn't go so well and I kept getting a poor connection. In the end I had to finish it early but this was after I'd got to a certain point in the story which <laughs> which was really difficult. So what I've decided to do is add it at the beginning of this. So it's going to be a little bit weird because it's going to obviously be a stream but uh, it'd be easier for me to edit and insert here and then I carry on recording what I wanted to record until I end up at the end. So I'm trying not to say too many spoilers about what happened. That's why it might be feel a little bit disjointed because I've tried to incorporate the stream into this as well and re-upload it. So anyway I hope you enjoy it. If, if you're enjoying this please do like, subscribe for more up and coming uploads. I do loads of guides, I'm doing lots of different playthroughs and I've got lots planned for the future so I hope you stick around. I also have a Discord channel. If you want to get to know me a bit more, come and say hi, leave a message in the general chat area. I'd love to meet you and get to know you all. Okay, with that said, this is today's episode. It's now morning. Uh, I've done some work on the background. What have I done? I've done some more exotic requests finished off getting all the spoon bills and all the herbs that went with it, the exotic herbs and uh, I got the spoon bills from here actually and that that's an amazing location to get spoon bills, literally you go here really quietly kill all the spoon bills and then reload your game and then go back and they're, they're there again, it's amazing and in no time so f before I go and speak to Dutch what I do want to do is go and see Algernon to hand in, I think it's number four, yeah, number f oh, five, yeah, number five. So, uh, I was running around here earlier, Abigail was getting anxious because uh, Jack had gone missing, so I hope he's turned up, I presume he'll be fine. And there isn't many people at camp either, so we're going to fast travel to Algernon. And uh, I was talking about the, I think it was the sharpshooter challenge, that I failed miserably on the last stream. Uh, I did manage to finish it in the end off stream, which was slightly less pressure. It took me like six goes. I went to Valentine um, and chose the poker players in the Valentine to um, shoot the hats off their heads. And once, once you work out how to do it, it's quite easy, but it does take a few... I'm not sleeping, I'm fast travelling, what am I doing? Um, I want to fast travel to San Denis. So once I've done that, then uh, there's not much else to do. I mean, I could go and see um, Henry Lemur, who wants to see me again, the mayor. But... Uh, that I can do that later maybe. Here we go. Try not to bump into anyone. Uh, when, when I was uh, up near Butch Creek earlier today, um, doing the Survivalist Seven challenge in the, you know, the, the there's like a cave near. Um, the pool there. Uh, all the Butch Creek residents decided to uh, attack me as well, so I ended up getting loads of bad honour. So poor Arthur's uh, honour is not looking good. I'm not too worried though. Hope you're going to give me lots of money for this, Algernon. It's the Contessa. She's insatiable. Insatiable! Thank God you're here. Thank you, God. I've been eating for days. I've gained so much weight. It's the worry, Tacitus. It's killing me. Uh, calm down, Algernon. This is calm. You should have seen me yesterday. I nearly ate the cat. She says such cruel things. 
Well, I got you the things for the girl in New York. That strumpet, I don't care about her. She's trade, she's <laughs> common. Her father lends money, it's so vulgar. Oh, damn her. It's the aristocracy. It's the old families. It's the last of the old guard. It's the Contessa Tacitus. I love her. Well, love or not, you owe me for these. Oh, money, dear boy, I don't give a fig for money. Here, here, take this money, money. Yes, we want Is money. Me. This? Quite oh, Arthur. Enjoy it. Uh, spend it on love. I need on to shave you. Beauty. On amore. Sure. Now, Tacitus, I need more orchids. Here, here's the list. These are very rare. I plan to declare mm. my love like a god. Mm. In flowers, in beauty. Oh, all my life, the times we shall spend by the lake in Lombardy. Oh, Tacitus. Well, it sounds... Divine. <coughs> it sounds divine. 175? That's not bad. Right, so... What have I got now? Clamshell, Dragon's Mouth, Queen's Orchid, Sparrow... I think, hopefully, I think that's the last one. But I'm not going to do it now, obviously. Because that would be far too boring. Hey, boy. But we are going to go and speak to Dutch. So, yeah, I'm doing quite well on the yeah. challenges, I think. Uh, I've got three left to go. Um, and they can wait. They, uh, you know, I can... Come here, please. Uh, no, you can see the I don't want to talk to you. Sorry. Come on, other way, people. How you doing, friend? Places to go. One of these. So, Dutch, what's the Haiti like, anyhow? Let's go. I have no idea, but I hear it's paradise. Arthur, there you are. Yeah, Come sorry on. to keep you waiting. I had some challenges and. Thomas. Some exotic things to going. collect. Right you are. <laughs> hey, Bill, you were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. Uh, Them Indians were savages. Watch him out there, boy. Watch it. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling, pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting way you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you though, I do. <clears throat> well, love, leaving love aside, I... <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. It's all we got. Now you pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Come on, quick. Stay quiet. All right, what we did? What we did? What we did? Can you just? Pressing the right button. Thank you, Arthur. Lenny, Bill, you're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay? Good luck, gentlemen. Arthur, let's go. We got this, John. Come on. <clears throat> let's go.
Find some cover. Two up ahead. You got a shot on him? Yes. Something creepy about these statues. I can get both. Uh oh. Got ya! Get out here, Stop hiding behind the pillar! Got him! This is not over yet! Head to the house! But is there any free hats before I go in? Shoot that lock, Arthur! No. Good. Now kick that damn door in. Look out. Well, let's go. What? <laughs> the the double barreled shotgun is pretty awesome. to look at that in a minute because <laughs> they're not going to kill it by themselves I don't think. Is that another thing? It's a bit annoying. Police like chief. Okay, let me quickly go and save them. It's amazing how they're all gunslingers and they can't kill one. I will. I'm just going to do some cheeky loot looting. Oh, he lost his head, look. I don't know why I bother. I don't really don't need all this crap. anything in here I hope I don't fall out the window. God damn it. Where are you? Gotcha! Oh no, I didn't. Now I did. Check every room. Where are you hiding? No one in here! Sorry about your head.
Look at that little. Oh, and look at this. Jewelry. Nice. Well, one more room, so I'm presuming this is it. Hi, cat. Hi. Got him. Oh, Bronte, is your okay. gun not working? I'm That's sorry, a shame. Uh, uh, no, name your price. Name your price. Every man have a price. Eh? Okay, okay. No, I surrender. I surrender. I... Should we kill him? Nah, let's take him to Dutch. You can carry him. I ain't touching that piece of shit. Let's go, Arthur. See, even though I got the Lamats out, it's given me a Schofield as well. Are we taking him to Dutch then? Hang on, John. Benefactor of the year. Like I said, you carry him. Anything else in here before I? Well, I'm gonna loot him. That's for sure. Woo! Right, let's go. Big Dutch wants to have a little chat, Mr. Bronte. How do they know it's me already? Why are you still We gotta get out of here? I'm trying, I can't walk that far. Out no, the way, Dutch. Yourself, police! Bronte's goddamn puppets! Everyone okay? Someone else shoot them. I'm getting to the boat. I'm getting to the boat. Put him in front. But right, cat, stop no. waving your tail. In oh come on, Lenny. All right, come on. Let's get out of here. Hey, big man. We gonna ransom you or what? Cause you're pussy. Oh, I am. Cause from where I'm sitting, you're the one deserving a pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men, all your money, it weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing. You mean nothing. You stand for nothing. Me, I run a city. <laughs> And when the law catch up to you, you will die like nothing. I am this country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. Oh, you don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you going to say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You are so right. <laughs> they are good at smelling filth, huh? So oh. filth has got to be disposed of. Oh. Our friends of oh. are gonna come and The music you. is chilling. Call them now. You call them. Jesus, what part of you 
your philosophy books cover feeding a fellow to a goddamn alligator, Dutch? The part that covers weakness. That part. I don't know. Well, I do. It ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. I figure it might as well be him. Mm. Definitely lost it, Dutch. I don't think Arthur and John look very pleased. So, we've got rid of Bronte, eaten by the crocodiles. Stop wanting my attention. I love you. Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, what's that called? I didn't think I'd made that. Yes. Nice. So, okay. What do we have? Uh, I have a bounty of $95. That's what I have. And I'm not sure we're welcome in Zandini at the moment. I do have this, but I'm not going to do it now. There's just no point. I can do that later. Um, I may as well just carry on I think with the I, th I mean this is a D mission which means it's the, the end of the, the chapter I think so uh, I mean, let's just do it what guns have I got on my back oh I, I don't think it matters ended up with a double barrel shotgun I think Jim look <gasps> Bank. Started straight Captain away with it. <laughs> Didn't care no choice. They all say the same thing. There's no more than one armed guard. And the police? It's a city. There are police. But as far as we can tell, the patrols will all be going this way when Abigail and I cause the diversion. That's the opportunity. What do you think, Arthur? I don't see we have a lot of choice. We linger around here. We know we're dead. But the plan? We got a decent bunch. We know how to fight. The city cops don't seem so tough as long as we move fast. I reckon doing it in the day with a distraction. That's what Jose is saying. It's as good a plan as any. I, I think I agree. Can we do it at night? There's the dram of just getting into the bank. Can't do that mm. silently. No, pick us off far easier. I know. I'm, I'm just making sure. Every plan is a good plan if we execute it properly. Every problem we had was because we did not execute properly even blackwater from my understanding you're right let's rob this bastard everyone get some rest we ride out in the morning look smart travel light okay we're gonna go and rob a bank you got everything arthur sure so we rob ourselves a bank and within Six weeks we're living life anew in a tropical idol, spending the last of our days as banana farmers. Let's get out of this godforsaken place and go banana rob farmers. ourselves a bank! Yeah! Suddenly everybody's there. Where let's were they go, all before? I, I couldn't even you. see John in camp. This is it, gentlemen. The last one. Where have we heard that before? What has happened to you, John? You lost all your heart. I'm just trying to stay real about all this. Real? Oh, how I detest that word. So devoid of imagination. How soon are we shipping out? Soon as we get a passage organized. Boat down to Argentina and another around the Cape. What about the money in Blackwater? <laughs> We're just going to leave that behind? Forget that. It's gone. You all talk like it's the only goddamn money in Typical the world. Typical, Micah. We're going to take that and more. Take it from the people who take it from us. This isn't some hick town hundred dollar operation. This is a big city bank. Yeah, he's right. definitely lost his With heart. Security, definitely. Guards, police. Jose has done his reconnaissance. We've been over this. He's lost the all player. his brain cells as well. One last time. 
Hosea and Abigail, draw out the police. We go in calm. And oh, fast. sorry, John. John and Lenny, secure the front doors. Javier takes the side exit. Phil, Micah, and Charles control the crowd. Me and Arthur deal with the bank manager and vault. Got it? Got it. Yeah. Got it. Good. Got it. All right, that's enough talk. Gentlemen, let us go ahead. I'm quite nervous. How long do you need? Not long. Fifteen minutes or less. Look at Don't John looking annoyed. all smart. Any problems? We'll see you in camp. He, he luck, de definitely right rocks the suit. Yeah. Everybody know the drill. We head in hard and stay calm. They won't be expecting us. Any minor trouble, head back to camp. We'll leave in a few days. You good, Bill? Sure. Then ride on with Charles. We don't want to be seen heading in like some posse of country outlaws. <laughs> this is it, cowboys! Which we are. <laughs> one more time! Well, one more time. Let's ride! Yeah! Do it! Can I just bash Micah off his horse? I mean, we don't look conspicuous at all, do we? <laughs> There's Bill. Let's hitch up here. All right, I want to make sure I've got the right ones. I want the Lamats. Gentlemen, robbing thieves, it ain't no crime at all. Folklore? And that split point, yeah. They stole what this country could have been. Stay cool, fellas. Act natural. Wait for Hosea to do his thing. I was going to go walk and look at, look at Mike and in his suit. Looks like there's law he won't let on me. the other side. Have a modicum of faith, John, will you please? Soon as we get out, load everything onto the wagon here. Wow. <laughs> I love that Jose. He's a true artist. So I guess now the police are all rushing over there. To where the explosion was. Oh, Javier looks very smart Let's too. Go. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a hold up. Don't do nothing stupid. Oh, yeah. That's probably drawn the police's attention. Where's the bank man? Over here. Okay. okay, now then, Arthur, would you please have Senior Bank Manager here open up the vault? <laughs> Look at this mask. Who is that? Who's. Is that Javier? Open the vault! Come on! Right, I'm going for the big one. I need the combination for these safes. Oh, I'm not very good at this. How about the combination? Come on, speak, speak or die. Now, first number, 19. Oh, I've gone past that. Oh, well. Got it. Okay, now, what's the second number? 
72. I'm trying to move it, it won't move. I've gone past it. How did I go past it? I'm trying. All right, there we go. One more number. Last number. Come on. 54. You get that, Mr. Ram. Okay, oh, I did it. I did it. I did it. What did I tell you? Holy shit. They were joking. Why didn't you tell me how much it was? Come on, what are go. you doing over there, Dutch? Okay. Think we got a problem out here? Come out! It's over! Shit! Abigail! Dutch! Get oh, out! Oh, here. here we go. Get out here now! Someone must have screamed. Oh, I don't want to watch this bit. Monte, Dutch. Mr. Milton? <clears throat> Let my friend go! Or folks, they are gonna get shot unnecessarily. Your friend? <laughs> Why would I do that? Come on, Milton. It's over. No more bargains. No more deals. Mr. Milton, this is America. You can always cut a deal. I've given you enough chances. Come on. This is all your fault, Dutch. If you'd listen to Hosea. There's your deal, Dutch. Hosea. Hosea! God damn it! Vengeance for Hosea. Did John? I got an idea. What? Just keep shooting. We really need a play here. Of course, Dutch, Dutch has got a plan. Get up. On it. Give me a hand, Arthur. Wagon's coming in on the left here. Where? 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 He is in moving. Arthur. Oh. You alive? Just about. Get over here. No, I'm busy. I'm helping Charles. Oh, missed. I like not listening to Dutch. It's the best thing in the world. He's gonna. <laughs> He's gonna get annoyed with me in a minute. I just love doing this. All right, all right, all right, Dutch. All right, all right. Let me get some of this first. All right, Dutch. Keep your hair on. Pretty good dynamite. I don't need it. How the hell did they know? There's gotta be a rat. You really want to talk about this now? Climb over. I have a good camera. Oh. You fellas, let's get up there. I'll cover the rear. We'll get them out of here. And we will. 
I want to climb up. Thank you. Come on, Arthur. We got this. We got this. I keep forgetting to press square to jump. Any more? Any more? Any more? Got him. Try and find a way across the roof, sir. If you'll cover us. Sure, sure. Go on. We can get across here. No! No! <sighs> Bastards! Dust! <sighs> oh, God damn them! Two! Hosea and now Lenny. I hope you're proud of yourself, Dutch. Run. Oh. Careful. There's more law down there. Everyone clear the area. Charles is beating me. Wow, look at that. In here. Come on. Come on. Oh, you just played I it, did you? Believe it. They knew we were coming. Just like your So you know what's on the other side? Nothing like that. What now? I don't know. I don't. <sighs> this whole town is filled with cops. Well, how long are we gonna stay here? Uh, a few hours? We go back to camp? They're gonna get every last one of us. I know they're gonna be watching the roads. What I find interesting about this mission it. is that... A boat. Micah is always wearing white. He's either we got a white hat or a white suit. We sneak on down to the and I just wonder if that's got significance. Yeah, well, where? Any place will do. 
That's all I got. We leave. We lie low. We come back for the rest in a few weeks. I'm guessing it's that. Or we die out there right now. Exactly. Now, everybody, calm down. I mean, oh, look at us. So we lost Sean, um, okay. Kieran, Follow me. Lenny, Hosea, down. John's gone missing. Come in, Dutch. I'm coming. Guards up ahead. What now? <sighs> just wait a second. I'm out. God damn it. This night just keeps getting better, doesn't it? Quick, get in cover and stay out of sight. We can't stay here. Let's cut through the train. Follow me. It won't let me go. It won't let me go. Someone's coming. Duck. I can't move. I can't hide behind the train seats because the game wouldn't let me move. Hey, I already checked the trains. You did? No more than a quarter hour ago. Are you sure? We're okay. Are we still hiding Dutch? Or are we going? Come on. Okay. Shit! Stop, Arthur! I want Dutch's jacket though, because oh, it's got a nice red in the We're inside. We're past these fellas. Arthur, head over to the water. See if you can draw them out. Draw them out? How? I don't know. Make a noise. Whistle or something. Oh, it's got some pot of food there. Got this, Dutch. I've got this. Huh. What was that? Where are they? Oh, they're there. <gasps> Follow Dutch. Oh, there he is. There he is. I did it, Dutch. I did it. Can I have some food? Everyone stay down and keep quiet. Oh, okay, that's the way. We've wasted enough time on these fools. Spencer said... See them? Sure. What you think? I don't know. They're watching for us. Maybe. Maybe not. Well, they ain't just waiting there for no reason. Yeah, let me think for a second. I'll deal with them. What? How? I can't kill all of them silently. So, when they chase me, you go the other way. What are you talking about? You heard what I said. Oh, I like it. Real brave. It just strolls right. in there. 
Who is? Excuse me, buddy. Hey, stop! 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 That is one of the most beautiful acts I ever saw. Come on. We can touch. From here. <sighs> what now? Well, at least we got some gold, I'm sure. Now, this boat ain't going to Tahiti by any chance. I don't know. John. Lenny. Jose. That wasn't good. I know. So what are we gonna do now? <coughs> Guess I'm gonna introduce myself to the captain. Give him some of this gold to secure his silence. And find out where we're heading. How do I look? Like a shifty, no good killer on the run from the law. Ain't that the truth? <coughs> Excuse me, sir! Hey, who are you? Forgive me! A stowaway. Can I see the captain, please? I come in peace. Well, it's gonna take a little more gold, but I think we're gonna be okay. This captain, he is a, a fine This boat fella, is not going to Tahiti. From the Cape. The rest of the ship is Frenchmen. They're heading down to the islands, taking some Pennsylvania coal. Now, apparently, we're going to be able to slip ashore in northern Cuba in a couple of days. Cuba. That's so. Apparently. What are we going to do in Cuba, Dutch? Hold up for a while, then hurry back, gather up the rest of our family. At least we got some money now. Money and loyalty. With that, you can do whatever you please. So you reckon they'll follow us to Cuba? Like Colonel Waxman on a jolly? I highly doubt it. I reckon we hold ourselves to ourselves, and this is done and dusted. Let's hope so. I ain't no sailor, but, uh... <clears throat> Okay, so finishing off from the from the live stream, which was awful. I'm going straight in and I'm recording this now, rather than live streaming it. Uh, so I'm going to carry on. I'm not going to chit chat. I'm going to carry on and let's get Guama done because we're in chapter five now. I'm probably going to have to repeat a little bit of this. I didn't realise it was going to bring me up straight into this bit again. But at least I don't have to worry now. I can just focus on the game and not worry about the stream. Right, so I did this bit on stream, and unfortunately it spoiled it for me because I was just worrying about what the, the connection was doing and everything, so it completely spoiled this bit for me. I'm so annoyed. So yeah, I was saying, when, when, I, when I was streaming, I was saying that um, this bit is just so surreal, like the, the, the way that the, they, they make you walk like this and... And you have no idea where you are. Completely shipwrecked. And poor Arthur's beard. Look at it. <laughs> oh, sorry, Arthur, I didn't shave you. I'm so sorry. What's that? Who's that running? I can't, I can't. I can't aim or anything. I wanted to see what it was.
Oh, okay. So this is the bit I got to. Chapter 5, go on. Thankfully my cat settled down now and he's fast asleep next to me. Oh dear, look at him. Poor Arthur. Look how beautiful this place is though. I mean, look at the... It just looks so real. It's absolutely incredible. I just... Uh, I just can never get over just looking at the surroundings whenever I play this game. It's just amazing. Better look at the smoke, as the game's telling me. There's the smoke. I just want to look at these waves. It almost feels like I'm on a beach right now. It's so real. Good boy. You're alive. Arthur. Oh boy, that's it. You're you're alive! <laughs> Arthur, you're okay. It is a miracle! It is a goddamn miracle! Here, have, have something to drink! Have a drink! Somebody yeah. give him a goddamn drink! Oh, son. Son, take it. Mike's belly button. Oh, we got you! <laughs> we got you! So, where the hell are we? We are on the island of Guarma. Javier asked a local. It's a old sugar plantation island. Second island, east of Cuba. Is it anywhere near Australia or Tahiti? It's on the way, I guess. No, <laughs> well, uh oh. What next? I don't know. <laughs> Behind well, you. Next, I guess we're gonna get shot. Gentlemen, this is quite a welcome. Who are you? Senor, por favor. We are no one. What's your name? Aiden O'Malley. Is that so? What are you doing, Mr. O'Malley? Surviving. We were lost at sea. In the storm. Is that so? No. I'm in the habit of looking like this. <laughs> Is all of this really necessary? We got enough. That's funny, Dutch. That was funny. Right now, Mr. O'Malley, without taking a chance on a bunch of vagabonds. Behave yourselves and no harm will befall you. Vamos! 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 That means move! You got a long walk ahead of you. Look at my health. Oh my god. No dead eye. Nothing. Levi Simon. Senior overseer for Alberto Fusar. We run the third most productive sugar plantation in the Northern Caribbean. Of course, where there's money to be made, there's trouble. What sort of trouble? Oh, the usual sort. People wanting what ain't theirs and others telling them to take it. I don't get you. Labor troubles. And other thieves and pirates looking to disrupt our ways of working. Well, how very upsetting for you. Not half as upsetting as it'll be for them. Mr. Fusar has a lot of very powerful friends. I will bet that he does. Bunch of Haitian pirates won't frighten him. They'll be strung up in the streets soon enough. And do we seem like Haitian pirates to you, Mr. Simon? seem like someone or other we was headed to Tahiti <laughs> you were going the scenic route just as soon as I know exactly who you are you'll be free in the meantime you'll not starve Cabo llévese a estos hombres a la carsa junto con el grupo de cucarachas de ese campesino cualquier tontería que hagan 
Dispárales a todos. Welcome to Guama, gentlemen. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah. Okay. What now, Aiden? Oh, what did you say his name is? What Aiden O'Malley. I think we've got to get out of here. <laughs> yeah, but they can't find out who we are. Well, for now, we're stuck then. Well, for what it's worth, I think I would have preferred Tahiti. <laughs> you and me both. Awesome, mates, we last. people who knows well they got them chained and lashed but they don't look too dangerous excuse me sir who are our new friends here <laughs> criminales what crime did they commit insurrection <laughs> insurrection that's quite a word Cállate, señor fuentes Muévate. todos I just want to go in, let's go for a swim! Okay, here we go. Try it! Got him! Oh god, I'm kidding. Oh, badly missing. Reinforcements. Oh, dear. We need to get out of here. Now we're in trouble. Come on, come on, David. Everyone, follow me. Please, David. Come, come, come. Oh no, heavy eight. Get out of here. Get out of here. There's a lot of them. What do you think? We gotta move, Dutch. Go. Don't lose face, son. We'll find you. Cooey, cooey. Go, go. Some gun stashed here. Come. Hey. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh, I missed him. Thanks for getting us out of there. Don't take me there. Bill, you're with me. Let's get up there! Ah! Arthur, you too! Ah! Push up on them! Ah! Is that all you got? I've got a bit of dead eye for you. Oh my god! Got him. They're running away. Oh, 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 oh. Got him. Come on, follow me. Quick. Yeah, 
I don't think I'm going to be getting any golds on Guama. <laughs> what you doing here? I have no idea. Running from somebody or something, I guess. How went we on? Hecule Fontaine. Dutch Vanderland. These drowned rats are Micah, Bill, and Arthur. Okay. Well, Fusa will be desperate to find you. We must be very careful. So, who is this Fusar? A tyrant. Driven by nothing but power and greed. Our only purpose is to work ourselves to death to make him rich. Leon wants the people to stand up to Fusa, but most are too afraid. And you? I am not from here. I bring things in and off the islands behind Colonel Fusa's back. Let's, uh, let's rest a moment. Down there is Aqua Dolce, Fusa's compound. The sugar cane these poor men kill themselves farming gets processed in that factory there. They're little more than slaves shipped in from other islands. A group escaped yesterday into the jungle, hoping to find a way back to their homes. Now Fusa's men are out hunting them down. That old fort? Cinco Torres. My men and I use that as a hideout when we are here. Come on. I know somewhere you men can rest. Can we trust you? I don't see you have any choice. I am the only one who can arrange nope. a boat for you. We're on our own. But I need something in return. Help Leon with that group of escape workers and then come meet me at the fort. If you help us get back our friend and get out of here, we will do everything we can. Thank you. Gracias. If your friend is still alive, they will have him at Fusa's compound. There is a cave hidden below the cliffs. It will lead you right there. Thank you. The workers are somewhere in the jungle. Hopefully we can get to them before Fusa does. Of course. Gentlemen. Well. Goodbye. If this is a tropical paradise, so far it ain't up to much. <laughs> I'll go scope the entrance to that cave. Park. Agree with Mike in there, strangely rest. enough. Well, you're right. We all need to relax. <clears throat> what a mess. I am so sorry, boys. Get some sleep, Dutch. Micah, guard this spot. Bill, uh, do some more scouting carefully. Well, yeah, silver, not bad. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, get ten headshots. That's not going to happen! Okay. This is our little camp. Is there anything around here? Oh, I can take some rum. Still can't believe it. I can't believe I'm being polite to Micah. Guess it's my turn for guard duty. Hosea was dying anyway. Lenny. Mm, well, you know what they say about pride before a fall. Oh, Micah. I don't know, I'm not talking to him. Oh, yes, I'll have a double barreled shotgun any day. What's this? Uh, cattle man or volcanic? I actually prefer the revolvers. I'm going to stick with the, re the cattle man. I don't know why I prefer revolvers. I guess I need to go... I think... I'll do that one first. Can I go this way? I'm not talking to Micah because he's just... Rude. Uh, maybe I can't go down that. Ah! Here already! Oh! Here we go. Oh! 
poison dart. Half that. Catch it again. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Where are you from? Where are you from? I'm asking you. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Arthur's like superhuman. All these punches. I'm an American. My name is Leviticus Cornwall. Quién es este hombre? No lo había visto antes. Me estaba siguiendo en el bosque. Un tipo raro. Um. Oh, rock. Okay. Come on, Arthur. Yay! Got it. Oh yeah, with pleasure. You okay? I don't know. Uh, maybe there's still time to get to the other workers. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, I think I hear voices coming from the other ruins down there. Let's sneak down and take a look. Which way? I'll show you. Baptiste, you don't look good. You should rest here. Okay, you'll need this. Oh. What is that? I bet that's like, a crappy old carbine repeater. Stay close behind me. I know a way we can. What is it? Yeah, what a surprise. Okay. Where did my double barrel shotgun go? Kill anyone. If they catch us, they'll murder the workers for sure. Who was that fellow? Shh. One of her fused men. Quick. Hide. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. Over there. I'm gonna go over here. Pero te voy a decir una cosa. Mi abuelo siempre dijo que la Guarma era la isla de la que Dios se había olvidado. Y después de estar aquí un mes, entiendo a lo que se refería. No hay nada aquí. Hay que regresar. Tan solo tres meses más y a casa. Por favor. Now what? Oh, he's moving. He's moving. Come on, follow me. I'm coming. The guard. Keep out of sight. What's this dude's name? Was it Leon? What's your name again? Se le pone tieso el tetito. Fue creado por Two more ahead. Take cover on the other side of this Oh, it's Leon. Yeah. Ratas. Creado por el mismo diablo. Can we just shoot them all? ¿Qué tal va todo para allá? Ya casi acabo. ¿Saben? Por mucho que disfruto, vi un socialista colgando. Oh my god. Ahorcar es un trabajo tedioso, ¿ah? Toma demasiado tiempo. Estás enfermo. Toca ver cómo sigan los prisioneros. A ver si el gringo ya abrió la boca. Claro que abrió la boca. Siempre lo hacen. We can go now, look, he's gone.
Let's go on, go. Let's go. Stay close. Maldito <laughs> bastardo. Uh. Just kill him first. I did it! Damn! They're coming from behind us! Oh shit. Shit! Yeah, exactly, Arthur. Got him! Got him! Shot his hat off. <laughs> oh my god, this is hard. Oh my god, I keep missing. Okay, this isn't working behind this pillar. Got him. That was a good shot. Oh god's sake. Gotcha. Oh, there's one up there. Where's this one hiding? I'll loot him. Let me loot him. Let me loot him. Let me loot him quick. Vengan, hermanos. Did I manage it? Bien. Este gringo valiente le salvó la vida. Thank you, my friend. I'm Baptist. I work with Hercule. We owe you our lives. Yes. Thank you. My pleasure. This place makes me miss home. Take care, my friend. Hercules is getting a boat lined up to get you and your men out of here. Just meet him at Cinco Torres. We'll be there. Good, good. Here, this is for you. Oh, money. Thanks. It's not much, but it's the least we can do. Good luck getting home. Oh, 400, was that four hundred fifty dollars? That was loads. Well, duty called. Over here. Oh, oh, buddy, buddy. What's that? Scarlet McCall. Mind you, I'm not exactly being quite stealthy. I'm just rushing in there. Uh oh hello. What were those? Sounded like piggies. Piggies Don't fly off Oh that one's dead look There's a dead one It's looking dangerously close to the Waterfall, though. <coughs> Let's see if I can pick it up. Ah! <gasps> I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Pick up. Look at that. Look. Pluck. Oh, I'm sorry, McCoy. You're beautiful. Parrot feather. Dutch is patiently waiting for me. Hey. 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 So, uh, what's the plan? Well, I found the cave Air Cool spoke of, and also a guide. She's up ahead. I think we can trust her. Follow me. The oh, we're going to shimmy. Here. Just watch your footing. So, uh, what do we do when we get Javier? Back? Well, uh, gonna get the hell out of here and set sail for the one place 
Ain't nobody gonna be expecting us. Get everybody together and get ourselves back on course. Where would that be? Place we just escaped from. <laughs> you wanna go back to Sandinay? If it was you got left, you'd want us to go back. I'd want it, but I wouldn't expect That's it. That's the point. Ain't no one gonna expect it. We come back from the dead, gather everyone, and we leave before anyone realizes we've even resurrected. An insect biting you or something? Cause you gone, friend. <laughs> we look like what we are. A bunch of desperados on the run. But with the women, a change of clothes, <laughs> we're a choir or a gang of pilgrims or something. Whatever you say. A bunch of penniless fugitives on some Caribbean dump. Sneaking through caves while two of our best men got shot back home. How could I doubt you, Dutch? You got no idea. Exactly, or... Alpha. No idea at all. I will do whatever it takes for us to survive. I guess that's what I'm afraid of. Hold on. Why? Gloria! What is the starting me? Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Dinero. The money, the gold. A key. Damelo. <laughs> oh, it's genuine, the old hag. Oh. Vamos. Vamos. Rápido. Now that gold right there, that's the last bit of gold I have in my pocket from the bank. The rest of it is the bottom of the sea. Exactly. You know, wasn't Fusar one of the fellas Bronte pointed out to us at the party in San Denis? Yeah. You're right. I knew I'd heard that name before. Yeah. So, I met up with Leon. That situation with the workers is dealt with. Captured, tied up, eaten, poor bastards. Oh, no, that was me. <laughs> Are you sure this her Q fellers ain't just using us? Almost certainly. But he's the best chance we have right now of getting out of this place. Won't be long before someone figures out who we are and sends word to the U.S. So what happened with John and that bank? He survived. Unlike dear Hosea and Lenny. The only one they took alive. Why is that, you think? I don't know. I was already on the roof. I didn't see it. And Abigail, I presume she was able to slip away in time. What are you talking about? You know, when I look back at all the chaos of the past few weeks, the apparent superficial chaos, I begin to wonder, maybe, for somebody, this is all going exactly to plan. I still ain't sure what you're saying, Dutch. Puede callarse ya, estamos cerca. The door is stopped. You'll have to lift it. Pardon me, my queen. <laughs> <coughs> Arthur, come help me with this. Just lift it. Okay, then. <coughs> Weakly. This way. See, then you pay more. Okay. More. Just a second. Pay more. Pay now. Dutch, what are you doing? Jesus! Easy, Dutch. What Jesus. was that? Horrible old crone. But you killed her. She was gonna betray us, Arthur. Couldn't you tell? No. Well, I got some Spanish. She was. Oh, you're such you a liar, Dutch. Folk, Dutch. I am just trying to make sure that some of us survive, Arthur. Now, 
Shall we proceed? I guess. Mm. Listen, <clears throat> son, you think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. So he's clearly showing survive. signs that he's going. No I mean, he's what? starting to so get paranoid about John. Trace, what'd she say? It was in her eyes, in the way she was leading he's us. He's completely but losing it. you knew Spanish. I know human beings, Arthur. Are you gonna strangle me next? I'm doing the best I can. I come from Mexico. I never met those men. Does anyone believe him? Oh. Mr. Simon doesn't believe you. Even the mule doesn't believe you. Eso ni fue para tanto. Si que deja de actuar. Sabemos que no estuvo tan fuerte. Fue bastante duro. No. La próxima vez será aún más duro. Bueno, ha sido un placer. Siempre me encantaron los mexicanos. ¡Vamos, carajo! ¡Vamos, carajo! ¡Vamos, carajo! ¡Vamos, carajo! ¡Vamos, carajo! Where are they putting him? We need to deal with them. Well, I'm sure you got some ideas. Shut up and help me kill them. On my count. At least you got still got a knife. Right. I'll take the left. Okay, let's hide the bodies. You grab that one. Over here. Let's head around the back of the building and see if we can find a way through. Oh, I can loot. That wasn't really helpful. Give me some dead eye stuff. Dutch. There he is. Let's go in there. Why? Well, you know me. Arthur will cause ourselves a little distraction and then poof, we will disappear. Come on then. Take the other side of this door. Ni es una civilización, un país civilizado. Me podría costar mujeres que usan zapatos. ¿Quieres algo de tomar? ¿Cómo sabías? Porque te conozco. Sí, escondí una botella. Voy a buscarla. Gracias. Ok, you take the nearest one on the left. I'll deal with his friend. Es una mierda. Got him. Over here. What are these? Elms. Oh. Shotgun. Yeah. I did have a shot. I don't know what happened to the shotgun. I don't your body. Okay. Now we need to create a diversion. Uh, what do you think? Find another old lady to strangle? <laughs> that is enough, Arthur. This is a war. Well, if this is a war, then we need to start Give me some dead eye tonic. <laughs> exactly. Is there any dynamite? Oh, no, we don't need dynamite. We got a furnace and lots of sugar. Sugar? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no problem. You'll see. <laughs> Go close the windows and the doors. Go on, quick. What do you want, cat? Yeah. You want attention? Creating no sus. 
This place is gone. Yeah, it is true. <sighs> have to muscle in, don't you? Kindling. All right, head on out and wait for me. I'll get this going. Okay. to that building when it goes up. Come on, we can hide behind that well. I'm just thinking I should take some of that. That place has to blow soon. Get ready to make a run for Javier. Good idea. <gasps> oh, frightened the hell out of me. Can we go? Which one? There's Javier. Got a feeling I need to kill these though. Yep. Oh. Got ya. Trying not to waste my resources too much. Hide in from me, Dutch. Got him! Oh, hello. I'm... Well... Come on then! Oh, for goodness sake. See, it was clear just now. I'm running. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run. Uh, got any 
more snake or no? I don't want to waste it yet. Come on, see if we can lose them in the fields. Head down towards the river. Oh god. Can't, can't run backwards. Can't see. Got ya. Come on, Dutch. Run faster. Run faster. Okay, let's go. You okay? He's passed out. We're dead. Uh, he'll be fine. I'll get him out of here. You stay here. Take care of these fools a bit. No problem. Go quick. This will give us a chance to get to Hercules Port. I'll meet you there, Archer. Oh, missed. He's that shooting at me up there, if I guess. Nice. Oh, he's sneaking up. Oh, completely missed. I was going to die then. Hell hath no fury. All right. Now, we did what it's literally non stop. Like I said, can't even have a break. Knows who you are and knows the price <laughs> on your head. It's a big problem. Uh, I see. But. If we can silence him, then I can help you escape before anyone has time to get here from America. That way, we all get what we want. We want to get the boat you promised us. And you will, but you have found yourself in the middle of a war, I'm afraid. Fuso has called in the Navy from Cuba. There's no way a boat could leave right now. Hercule! Hercule, s'il vous plaît! Vite! Vite! Come, follow me. I'm coming, I'm coming. So now we have a real problem. This must be the boat he called in from Cuba. That's a goddamn warship. You kinda have to hand it to this fella. So I guess great minds think alike. So what now? We fight or we won. Any of you boys feel like running? <laughs> Where to? So what do we do? I will go get the cannon ready. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> Fork. Shoot them, man! Oh my God! Shoot them! Pillars on the beach! I see. We got more coming at us on the right. Uh, let's prepare the welcoming party. Why the hell are we doing this? This ain't our fight. Do you want to get off this island or not? He's using us! Look out on the left here, boys! God damn it! You said you were getting us that ah! goddamn boat! Uh, that wasn't a headshot. I am. What do you want to do? Oh, God damn it. I'm gonna need your help, my friend. Sure. Come on! Damn! This is heavy. Yeah. 
So what do we do? I say we push forward because if we don't, we're gonna die here and now. Okay then. Follow me. This is kind of fun. Uh, Did you just say this is kind of fun? God, I can't even aim. Ah! Oh. Is he stabbing? He was about to stab me. I did terribly there. There are too many. We must stick close. I'm gonna kill you so good. Come on, let's move down. Yes, we need to push them back. We need to stay together. <laughs> the sheep just hit their own men. Very kind of you, Mr. Fusar. They are boats coming from both sides. Damn it. What do we do now? I think I got a plan. You cover the left side. Okay. And you take the right, Hercule. Got it. Good luck. Ah! Oh, just ran straight into the fire. Right, old boats. Here we go. That you're not doing very well on this side, are you? Oh! There's a few left now. Let's get down to this. Got ya. Not getting off that boat. Got him. Ah, Alright, I'm trying. I'm trying. Is there any bodies to loot? Where's all the bodies? Oh well. What do we do? Two of us must go and use the cannon. You go, Arthur. I'll gladly hold them off this beach a while longer. You sure? Just certain, son. Finally, the Dutch is actually Wait doing something. Can. I need to do. Yeah. That's better. You think that cannon will be enough? Only one way to find out. Christ's sake, how many men has Fusar got? That's the problem. It doesn't matter how many we kill, he will have the money to get more. Oh, can I do? Yeah. Dead eye, please. Dead eye stuff. Yes. Watch out! Uh. Down. We will have to climb up around the side. This way. Up here, Arthur. You made the gunner. I get you some more shot. Everybody, what a night. We need to put a serious hole in that boat. Got it. Lance it, keep firing. That one definitely hit. I thought I'm in this one. 
Reload, come on! Oh, I missed it. How did I miss it? There we go. <laughs> yes, they're going down. Amazing. Let's get down from here. Come on. How could <laughs> a few of those be all those soldiers? Some shooting boys. Thank you. What now? Oh, they'll be back. But I found a boat for you, and he should be arriving on the dock any time now. Great. Micah, go meet with the captain. If he's amenable and discreet, tell him we'll be ready to set sail soon. Bill, come help me collect poor old Javier. Sure. And cool. It was a great pleasure to make your acquaintance. Birdies. <laughs> wow, these dramatic scenes are just amazing. Just casually strolling over the bodies. I thought I was dead for sure. Hi. Boys, we got a real problem. Nice Mr. Fusar don't want us going nowhere. He knows just who we are. If he can keep us here for a few more days, well... And what about the captain of the ship here? They got him trussed up like a hog. Guards all over the place. Got us surrounded with gun positions, so when we try to sail out, he's gonna blow holes in us. This fella is really beginning to try my patience. He ain't even had you tortured yet. <laughs> I like the man's style. He's thorough. Nasty and vindictive. However, in this instance, I don't see we got any alternative, but we go and free our friendly captain and destroy the artillery. For once, I agree with you. Here, cool. Oh, I'll fight Alberto Fusa every day I can. All right. Bill, you're going to guard Javier on the ship here. Micah, Arthur, let's get to work. Here, cool. We follow you. Hanale, this way. Let's get up around the back oh. of that artillery post. Got some dynamite. There's two guards. Arthur, come on. Get your knife ready. It's ready. You take out the first guy, and I'll get the other one, okay? Okay, got this. Got this, my guy. Plant the explosives. You got it secured properly, cowpoke? I think so. Knowing you, I have my doubts. Shut up, Mike. Exactly. I was about to say <laughs> that. Come on, run! Not There's anymore, he's not. Ah! Is this bloke still here? Yes. Let's go push up on them. Head up the stairs and get the rest of them. <laughs> We're here for a second for the others to catch up. Oh, I'll get the quick. dynamite rigged on these cannons. There'll be more coming. We'll hold them off. Up here, Arthur. We'll have a better view. Oh, don't give me that crap. Get up here, Arthur. 
Oh, I'm coming. More Fusos men coming through the field. Okay, come on. Let's kick them off before they get too Nice. Any more? Any more? Any more? You? How are you getting on with those cannons, Micah? Nearly there. Oh, okay, I'll get too close. We are live. Stand back. The cannons <laughs> being held in the workers' compound. This way. Going in? Let's go! The captain's in that blue building! Straight ahead! Okay, let's deal with these bastards first! Oh yeah! Come on! Push up on them! Damn, missed him. Get up from that! Ah! See a free hat. I mean, it's probably going to look well nasty. I think I prefer the other one. Goodbye. Oh my god, that hat looks awful. All right, you get the cabin out of that cabin. We'll cover things out here. I got you now, you bastard. We are all bastards, my friend. But only one of us is some would-be emperor's whore. We know who you are. Good line. And nobody knows who you are. Not even your goddamn father. You maggots are going to die. Eventually, I'm sure we will. But not today, and not because of you. The U.S. Navy is on the way. I am sure they are, which is why you're going to let us leave. Or you are dying right here, my friend. We've killed better men than you <laughs> fools. Enough. Oh, I've had enough of this. Arthur, the rifle? Sure. Are you men going to give up? Let us leave? Um. Are you going to die? Put your guns down. Here! Nice. Hey, got him. You saved my life. Thank you, Captain. I suppose you men are my cargo. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am sorry you got hurt. Uh, Captain Sam. Let's go. Gentlemen. Oh. Back to the ship. Come on. What happened to F Bouchard? He escaped? I didn't see him. Damn it. They have sent reinforcements. I can't even shoot something straight ahead of me. Keep going. <laughs> Another one. Shoot him. Welcome. Let's go. I'm going, I'm going. Hey, Fusa is up there. In the tower? Yes. Yes, that's him. This goddamn idiot. Come on. He's shooting. We have to take him down. There's another cannon up ahead on our left. Can you get to that? I'll try. Um. Oh, here it is. 
Found it. Ah, I think he might be dead now. I got it for you, Javier. <laughs> Captain, can you handle the ship? I'll be fine. Whew. Come on. We'll get going with the tide before I get any more surprise interviews with local officials. Are you gonna be okay? We'll be like you. We'll disappear probably. Back to IT. Believe me. We'll be long gone by morning. Good. Thank you. Maybe we should go to Haiti, but <sighs> <laughs> We survived. Just about. What now? What now? What well, we survived Guama. I mean, we're headed back to Lemoyne again, and we're all wanted men. <laughs> we slip ashore one by one, find out what's what. We don't cut and run now. Head back to Blackwater. No. Why not? Because the last thing they'll be thinking is for us to turn up. We've been on the run for a while now, and it feels like like our luck is turned. You know, and I ain't turning back. We had a good run of it, I guess. We ain't even played our hand yet. We just need to put some more money in our pockets. Make our escape. Broke, alone, they're gonna pick us off one by one. And you know it. Maybe. Not. Maybe. We need to split up. Keep a low profile. Try to track down the rest. But carefully. See if they send any mail. Arthur, you check Shady Bell. We'll find each other eventually. We always do. And then what? Then we meet up. We gather the family, we get some money, and get the hell out of there. That's the plan. We all acting crazy. And uh, that's not what I thought we were going to be doing here. We have here. been in a bad it's way. true, Javier. Listen. I will kill for my family. Any of you want to judge me for that? That's fine. But that is who I am. Anyone disagree? Anyone? Me. Dear Uncle Tacitus. <laughs> Bit of water in that boat. <laughs> I'm surprised it made it to shore. Bad horn. Okay. I really need to get rid of this really bad hat. <laughs> so I did, yeah, I did get $450. So I know I need to get on this horse. But I'll tell you a story of the, the first playthrough I did of this. I was so confused and I was so scared about stealing a horse that I went all the way to the stables to see if I could get my horse out. And I couldn't get the horse out. And I was so confused I didn't know what to do. Until I realised that I was supposed to get on this horse because it's actually my horse. This is actually a really nice horse. Hello, pussycat. Okay, let's check out Shady Belt. I'm just going to sit quietly and listen to this amazing song. It still gets me. I've uh, I've done a few since a few playthroughs since doing um, the guides and stuff, but I never get to this stage. So it's really rare that I get to do this. This is just amazing. I can't remember the last time I did this. 
I mean, it's probably like I've only done it like once or twice, maybe once. I can't remember. This, this is you know that the game is really changing when you get to this bit. there. Well timed as well. Yeah. Here we go. Hello? So everything's packed up. Susan! Strauss, you here? I'm trying to get that... Oh yeah, pocket... Pocket watch! Hello? Dear Uncle Tacitus, I do so hope you enjoyed your vacation. Lucky you, leaving like that. And you always suggested you were too old for travel. I hope you and your cousins enjoyed yourselves. Me and your grandnieces have decided to take a trip of our own, as the place has become so dreary and godforsaken in your absence. We have gone to visit relatives. From my daddy's side, you are not yet acquainted with them, in Lacay, a oh, small village just north of Saint Denis. It's buggy and muggy, but apparently neither is too bad at this time of year. Please come see us when you can. Yours sincerely, Caroline. Well, thank you, darling niece Caroline. Melton keeps sending us back every uh -oh. day to search this place. There quite clearly isn't a gang of outlaws held up here. <laughs> Someone is here. Look, those are Pink fresh tins. footprints. Looks like someone might be here right now. Sure, someone is here. There's always someone everywhere. Well, let's look around then. See if we can find something for Mr. Milton. Mr. Milton? I'd like to find a poisonous snake for him. That's enough, Mr. Johns. You take Mr. Bunter and search around back. Mr. Orley, let's head inside. Gentlemen, be careful. <laughs> Nearly got spotted by him then. Horse. Not taking their horses. Your horse is lost. My beautiful dark Turkoman. man. Dark bay Turkoman. Idiot. <laughs> Made it. This is a long one. Literally, from the moment you get to Guamo, it's just non stop.
Hello. Arthur, Arthur's it's here. Jason. Oh, oh. Arthur. Oh, Happy girl. And was that? About. Yeah. Come inside. Come on, it's raining. You. Hey, everybody, look who's here. How y'all doing? Hey, old man, wake up. Hey, Arthur, they got John. Good to see you. Yeah. He oh, got yeah. Arrested. He ain't hung yet? Got John got arrested. Not yet. They moved him to Sisica. He's been working on a chain gang. Uh, howdy. <sighs> Micah got there very quickly. Oh, oh, who's that? Okay, okay. Hey. <laughs> oh, close back. Find each other. What happened? Can can somebody give me a cup of coffee or something? Was Mrs. Adler who saved us, Dutch? After the robbery in Saint Denis, she got us away from the camp before the Pinkertons turned up. Then Mrs. Adler and Mr. Smith drove away the degenerates of a living here. Mrs. Adler, we. Oh, you. Yes. yes. <laughs> Thank you. It's been real hard, Dutch. We, we've been surviving, but only just. What we gonna do? Things have been tough. There ain't no doubt about that. Trust me. I am gonna get us out of here. This ain't over. Ain't none of you folks interested in our adventures? Mm. Guess we're more <laughs> interested in escaping the hangmen on our tail? Cheerful nymph of the prairie, wasn't you, Abigail? Oh, sure. My fair heart jumps for joy when I set eyes on you, Micah. <laughs> <laughs> we buried Hosea Dutch. Charles and I stole his body from the law one night and gave him a proper burial. It was real nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, here you Lenny? is. Well, I asked everyone I could find, and eventually someone new said you fools were out here. Shit. Give me a drink or something. Get your own damn drink. In our absence, Mrs. Adler here has been looking after things. Now sit down. This is Agent Milton with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Already? On behalf oh, of Cold Wall, Kerosene, and Tar, the United States government and the Commonwealth of West Elizabeth. Here we go. We are here to arrest you. Come out with your hands up. <laughs> get them to a count of five, then get Oh my god, there's Gatling gun as well. Actually, let him have it. Oh. <sighs> Ask everyone you could find, did Arthur, you? Arthur, phone me. This is real bad. You stay down, Ollie. Wow. God damn it. Where are we going to say on this show? Where are we going, Sandy? Come on. Where are we going? Yeah. This way. There's a trap door into the other house. We can try to flank them. Get up here! I am! Oh god, here we go. I'm gonna get them all, I'm gonna get them all. Any more, any more, any more, I think that's it. Got him! stuff back now. Thank you. 
even save him. Bill, your head is in the way. Where is it? God, I'm. <sighs> I'm terrible at this. Okay, son? Sure. We ain't been back for more than a few days. What, what do we do, Dutch? Clearly, we need to leave. It'll take them some time to regroup. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, start packing up. Javier, you and Bill, get out of here. Go scare off any scum <sighs> still loitering about. We need a couple of days. Now, please, gentlemen. Sure. What next, Dutch? We just need some time. I just, I, I need some time. Now, we can't go east, because then we'll be in the ocean, so we're going to have to go north, I guess. I just need somebody to buy me some goddamn time, one of you. You'll figure it out, boss. You always do. What are you going to do about John, Dutch? John? He's in jail. Well, we'll get him. Abigail, just not, not yet. There's talk of hanging him. It's not going to come to that. Dutch! Not now! You know, it's the parallel of not now. Micah now. I'm begging Compared you to, to Arthur at the beginning when Arthur They're was like, you figure it out, you always do. And now Mike is saying it. Heart, please and Arthur something. isn't. Okay. I'm going to go figure out how we rescue this bastard. No. Yes, now. Give me a Doyle's Tavern, a million Avenue. Okay. My lord, what a goddamn mess. Everything. Not sure what happens next. The whole thing has been hard on all of us. Most of all on Dutch, who seems half crazed by all we've gone through. Wow. And the most important thing is I've got my horse back. Look, this is my horsey. You're gonna get a little brush. And you want something to eat. I hope they looked after you. Look at you, gorgeous. Well, I finally made it. We're almost into chapter six now, and as I was saying, it's I rarely get to this point because I'm doing guides and I'm repeating like chapter two and chapter three all the time, and I rarely get so it's a I'm so happy I've got to chapter six, even though I know what the implications are because I've played it before. But uh, it's been ages since since I've done chapter six, so I'm super excited to be, to be here now and to be doing it. So. Um, Thank you for watching. I apologise for the mess up of the stream beforehand. I hope you enjoyed this one. I'll be back 
where we're going to go and rescue John and that will lead us into chapter 6. So if you like this playthrough, like my guide, if you want to hear more and see more guides then please do subscribe, like, comment. I do have a Discord as well, you can join, you can come and uh, get to know me and uh, leave me messages and chat with me. But for now, I will see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.